One of the disadvantages of wooden planes compared to metal planes is that they require a little more maintenance, um, what with the seasonal changes in humidity. Uh, we're all aware of how wood reacts to these changes um, and that you may need to flatten the soles of your planes, especially your finer planes, maybe once, maybe twice a year. Now, obviously, to flatten a wooden sole is considerably easier than flattening a metal plane. So that's the good news, and I'm going to show you a quick and easy way of doing this. So, I've taken a sheet of 180 grit sandpaper, and I've placed it on a flat surface. I'm using a, a granite surface plate here. Then you take your plane, you want to retract the iron, just take it back, say 6 mil. Then lock the wedge off again at your regular sort of performance tension. Then take one stroke on the sandpaper, firmly and gently. And then flip the plane over. And as you look down the sole, you should see that scratch pattern from the sandpaper. And looking at this plane, I can see immediately we've got an air, a low area just in front of the mouth. And a little low area there just at the back of the sole. So I'm going to take another couple of strokes now. Again using even tension. Yep, and we've almost got rid of those low points. Bingo. And there we are. We've now returned that plane sole to being as flat as your flat surface. The advantage to using this method is that you remove very little material. So fears about opening the mouth by constant sole flattening, it's going to take you a long time to have any major effect on the, uh, the size of the mouth opening.